Yo, what's up everybody? Uncle Jesse back at it again. Uh, it is that time for our uh, first and only eBay break of the day. 2019 Gypsy Queen Baseball 5 box break number 1 for eBay. Let's do it. As usual, a little dark. Oh! There we go. All right, I can see I might have to adjust the settings a little bit. A little too bright for my liking. If it bothers me, it probably bothers you. So. That looks okay to me. Much better right there. A subtle, little subtlety, subtle difference, but makes a world of difference to me. Anyways, hope everybody's having a good weekend. Sunday, uh, April 31st. Well, I'm sorry, March 31st. April is uh, tomorrow. So be careful with those uh, huh, April Fool's jokes. The Heat beat the Knicks the uh, last night. That was nice. To move back into that eighth place. We got a big game tomorrow against the Celtics. We got a difficult season to, I mean, a difficult few games to finish out the season. All right, so this Gypsy Queen is a five-box break. I would have to check the listings. I don't know if, uh, matter of fact, let me check that out real quick. What's up, Jimbo? How are you? Yeah, Fitz, that, that, uh, I don't like how, like, people have been, boot, like, really been talking about that. Because he clearly, like, D. Wade clearly says, oh, dude, I, you know, I'm giving it to someone else. You know, my lip reading ability is not what it used to be. But I can kind of make out that he's like, yo, I'm giving it to someone else. Like, somebody already called dibs on it. And I mean, not for nothing, but but, but who the hell is Emmanuel Moutier? He's, he's had his moments, but come on. Did you hear what Gilbert Arenas uh, said about Zion? He said he has no skills. And he's not lying either. Zion is 6'6", 285. Sounds like a beast. But he weighs the exact same Shaquille O'Neal did his rookie year in the NBA. Except he's not 7-something. You know what I mean? Shaq is like seven feet two or something like that. Zion's only six six. So something's gonna have to give with that kid. No skill, undersized. You know, they're probably gonna put him at the three. I that's what I've been saying, man. I've been saying it for a while now. I really think he should stay behind one more year in college. Just so that he can work with Coach K. Get his, you know, get his skill level up. Maybe drop 20 pounds, which would make a world of difference for a guy like him. If he could get down to like 240, 230, woo, he would still be, he'd still be strong as hell. Bro, Duke has gotten by this tournament on pure luck for real. I think they play, who they play, Houston the other day? The Elite Eight, well, there's there's two games on today. I don't think Duke is playing today. Okay, let me check. UConn, Louisville. And 
Who else plays today? Oh, Duke is playing right now. They're playing Michigan State. And UConn already played uh, Louisville. UConn beat Louisville. Yeah, I just I just seen that uh, face. They they just started too. It looks like Michigan stayed up ten four. UCF exposed Duke, man. Low key UCF should have won that game back in the round of uh, thirty two. I thought WrestleMania was today for some reason, but it's not. Next week. Anyways, let's see what we got here. Good old Gypsy Queen. Got the Exit Tarot Card Carry Kimbrell Red Sox. Blake Snell, fortune teller for the Rays, mini. Hey, Mayor Candelario for the Tigers to 250. Got to check the backs of this stuff for the old bazooka backs, which are about four per case. Thank you, Face. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. Likewise, my dude. Likewise, there's the uh, logo swap Bregman Astros. Fortune Teller Mini, Nola Phillies. I hear they're already booing uh, Harper <laughs> out there in Philly. The no name plate for the Royals, Brett Phillips. What's going on, Scotty Too Hotty? How are you? Hope you're having a good weekend, my dude. Gotta love Philly fans, man. They don't call it the uh, city, the city of brotherly love for nothing. Fortune Teller Freeman Braves. The World Tarot Albies Braves. There's our autograph. About two per box. I saw that too, man. Philly's going to be nasty. Mike Fultinowix for the Braves. Not numbered, but still autographed. At least on paper. They got Jordan Howard at running back now. They got Deshaun Jackson back. They still got Wentz. So we're going to see what he if he's really the franchise quarterback. Diaz, Mets, Fortune Teller movie. I'm still a little upset that the Dolphins did not make an effort. To try and get uh, Nick Foles. A little aggravating being a Heat fan. I mean a Dolphin fan. Hank Aaron. The uh, retired player short print for the Braves. Let's see if this got a bazooka back. It does not. I got a full case of this stuff in the store. If you guys are interested. Check out RipCityCars.com. I think there's about 15 teams left. Once all teams are sold out, we'll go ahead and break it. I think we can do that today. There's the other, uh, the other autograph. Willie Adams for the Rays. Autograph Magic. Okay. 
King of Swords, Stanton Yankees tarot card. Uh, I not that I can recall. There's a bazooka back right here for Max Kepler of the Twins. I oh Cork Kings, Cork Kings basketball comes out Wednesday, and I think that's it. What's up, Luis? Oh, not cool, Jimbo. What's up, man? That sucks. Well, we have one last case. That should be a banger. Especially with uh, Uncle Jesse on the job. Man, I had to buy a new battery for my car. And just when I was like, oh, you know, I, I got paid my taxes or, or whatever. So that that was a that 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 hurt my soul. Paid close to two thousand dollars in taxes. But anyways, that aside, I'm like, yeah, bro, I mean, you know, I'm gonna start saving money. You know, I'm not gonna go out to eat any, as as much anymore. And sure enough, as soon as I get paid, fucking battery dies. And I have one. I have one of those uh, the uh, the Optimo batteries, which is like the best one you can get. The uh, the yellow top, the yellow top, I think is what it's called or whatever. Anyways, I got that. I had got that battery initially, like back in 2014 when I first bought the car. And dude, that battery lasted me like close to five years, which is pretty good. Bad, you know, that's about the average battery lasts anywhere from like three to four years. So I just I figured I'd make that investment, dude. It's always something, right, Fitz? I dude, I yo, it's so annoying. Luckily for me, I was with one of my best friends, so we we went golfing. I actually did pretty good. Uh, I haven't gone golfing in like close to like a couple months, so it, it felt nice to get back out there on the range. And dude, I was I was doing pretty well considering my time off and my skill level where it's at. Get back to the car. Oh, battery's dead. And luckily for me too, like I keep like a little toolkit in my car. You know, obviously you gotta have you gotta have the uh, the a spare tire, the thing to the jack to lift the car up for that. I got that in my car. You know, a few years ago I made like a, I went to Walmart and I bought like, you know, the, the cables for the the charging cables or whatever. I bought like these little like two like a screwdriver kit and like a wrench kit and like I just keep that in my car for like emergency. So. That was an adult date for your boy. And it is such a pain. Uh, Louise, I'll probably do that at the end. Uh, well, not at the end of the night, but after this break is done. Anyways, uh, King of Wands, Aguilar, Tarot Guard. For the... Who we play for? For the Brewers? Dude, uh, that gala, man. That gala. It's been in the store for a while now. Let's see if, uh, if a miracle can happen tonight. D. Gordon, Gypsy Queen, Mariners, with the uh, logo swap there, is what I meant to say. I'm just glad I had money to buy f to, to pay for that battery. It was like a $300 battery. But it's, it's a nice investment. Now I don't have to worry about that battery for like another five years. Jose Martinez, Cardinals Autograph. Check the bags for them bazookas. And no nameplate for the Red Sox, Chris Sale. Fortune Teller Mini, DeGrom, 
mit I know it's gonna be tough, I know it is. But if anybody could do it, it's me. Trevor Richards, Marlins to 250. It'll it'll break at some point this year. Yeah, I have no doubts about that. Before 2019 is over, that will break. I guarantee it. Fortune teller mini bias for the Cubs. How's the wife doing, Jimbo? Gypsy Queen is tricky because there's variations in the stuff. Wheel of Fortune are not a Rockies tarot card. We do have a, a, a sorting team. They've been trained. They know what to look for. So if I miss anything... You know, usually you guys are pretty good in the chat. Like, hey, dude, you missed such and such. Go back and get it. Uh, but, hey, we are all human. Last time I checked. And, you know, we make mistakes from time to time. Luckily, we have more humans uh, that will cycle through the stuff and make sure that uh, any variations get the love and respect they deserve. But uh, I am the first line of defense. And I'm pretty dang good, if you ask me. Glaber Torres, Yankees mini, fortune teller situation. Now, how about Milwaukee? They got the uh, the reigning MVP with Yelich, and they're probably going to have the NBA MVP in Giannis. Ty Cobb, Tigers uh, retired player SP. Well, that's good news, Jimbo. Not so much the going back to work, because who likes to go to work? But I'm glad that she's getting better, man. Scherzer, fortune teller, Nationals, me. I got my doctor's appointment coming up in a couple of weeks, so I'm a little excited about that. I've already been doing research on, like, different solutions for my sleep apnea, and I think, well, depending on the severity of it, which I don't know what that is yet, Gregory Polanco, it's a 50 for the Pirates there. I will, If I have the option, I'm going to go with the mouth guard. Dylan Cozens for the Phillies autograph. And it's got the bazooka back. Numbered 1 of 25. Very nice. <clears throat> Pretty freaking sweet. Phillies. Nice. There you go. Well, I mean... I just, I'm just glad that she's doing well, man. For the Braves, no nameplate. Ender NC Art K. The World Otani. Tarot card for the Angels. Excuse me. My, uh, one of my cousins came over last night to the house, had dinner or whatever, brought his kids. And uh, one of my little cousins, who's like 11 years old, he's almost as tall as me, and he's 11. Never been to a Heat game, never been to a freaking, never been to the Marlins Stadium. So I was like, dude, I'm going to take you on these days. And he got all excited to be a kid again. Must be nice. Listen, Jimbo, listen, I, I, as a lone wolf, I completely understand. You know, like, this entire weekend, I stayed home, dude. Like, I did not, like, I might have left my house to, like, put gas in my car. Well, yeah, that's actually why I left the house. And that's it. I stayed home the entire weekend. You know, after I had to buy that battery and all my bills are due like the first couple weeks 
uh, the first two weeks of, the, of any month is when most of my bills are due. So I made sure that I, I got this upcoming week's bills paid, so I don't have to worry about that, but I just got to make it to Friday. I got like 40 bucks to my name. But nah, man, I, I stayed home. And I'm probably going to continue to do so, so I can stack this paper. One of my best friends had a, had his birthday uh, on Saturday, well, last night. I didn't go out because I already know. I got credit cards. I'll just, I have a problem with spending. Like, I spend it faster than I make it. So, I'd rather just not be in the position to spend money. Because I don't have self-control, as you can see. So I just made a grown decision. You know what? I'm just going to stay home. Hashtag adulting. Hashtag growing up. Hashtag why can't I be rich? And I'm on box three of this stuff if anybody here. Uh, just keep it count. Where'd you go, Jimbo? Uh, you claim to be out all weekend. Ah, ha, ha, ha. You know we're gorgeous, Jimbo. You know this. Don't don't pretend. <clears throat> Altuve Astros fortune teller me. Check the backs for them bazookas. Well, there's something here, so I'm just going to show it. Mitch Hanniger for the Mariners. That is number to 150. Decent. Urias, Padres, working on mini. Excuse me. DeGrom for the Mets. That is to 250. Ten of Swords and Canarcion, Mariners. Tarot card. No nameplate for the Pirates, Kevin Kramer. Ah, Jimbo was telling people what to do. Feels good, right? J.D. Martinez, Fortune Teller Mini for the Red Sox. Carlos Rodon for the White Sox to 50. You guys got Costco out there? Nice. J.D. Martinez, Red Sox, tarot card. I like those tarot cards. I wonder if, they're, if they have any, like, autographs for them. I have yet to see one. I've seen, like, mini autographs. No tarots, though. Nothing there. Dag! Sometimes I forget 
uh, forget that Australia is freaking huge. Aaron Judge, fortune teller, Yankees. Jake Cave with the logo slot for the Twins. There it is, Reggie Jackson of the A's, the retired player short print. Almost through. Got two boxes left. Hey, a redemption for Yusei Kikuchi. I do believe that's a Mariner. Got to look that up on the checklist. That's a big time hit I hear uh, that he might be this year's Otani. I'm pretty sure he's a Mariner. Taro for the Mets and Diaz. Two boxes left. Let me find this checklist real quick. I'm pretty sure they got Kikuchi as Mariners, though. But better safe than sorry. All right, do the old Control F. Kikuchi is indeed Mariners. It's nice to be right every now and then. All right. Boom. There you go, Mariners. Sweet hit there with the Kikuchi. Redemption Mojo. And let's continue with the rest of this stuff. This is box number four. Almost done. But like I said, I do have a full caser in the store. I got a full case of Gypsy Queen. All you got to do is go to RipCityCards.com and pick up your team. Once it's all sold out, we'll go ahead and rip it. I think we can do that tonight. Duke is up nine points right now. Curious to see what these emails are about. What game is that Duke game on? Or I should say, what? <laughs> no, wow. What channel is that Duke game on? On the old Espen? Ah, Jimbo, I forget that, that it's Monday uh, where you're at right now. I forget you're a time traveler. It's on CBS, he says. Thank you, uh, Andrew. Coming through in the clutch. Put this thing on the side here so I can 
multitask, Duke up by nine with about five minutes to go in the first half. Virginia beat Purdue. Auburn beat Kentucky. What? Auburn? Damn, Duke's been on a 21 to 5 run the last six minutes. Sheesh. All right. Let's see what's in box four. Come on. No nameplate for the Reds. I just got an update on my phone. Apparently, Christian Yelich had himself a day. That's literally what it said. I, I didn't read what qualifies as a day. Redlander, fortunes on our mini for the Astros. What do you do? Like hit a cycle or something? Zion got seven points, two fouls. Frustration. Max Muncy, Dodgers autograph, right hurt. Not numbered or anything. Oh, I see a bazooka back. Let me just grab it right now. There's a bazooka back right there for Kyle Wright, rookie for the Braves. Okay. The Joker, Acuna, Braves tarot card. Soto, fortune teller for the Nationals, maybe. Ryan O'Hearn, Royals to 250. Chris Bryant, Cubs, Fortune Zone, maybe? Wow, Jimbo. Wow. Can't win them all, man. Nice. A logo swap, veteran short print for Ivan Rodriguez of the Rangers. Very cool. One of the greatest uh, catchers of all time right there. Kluber, the Magician tarot card for the Indians. Until five-point game, Michigan State coming back a little bit here. The Emperor, Mookie Bet, Red Sox, tarot. Arenado, Rockies fortune teller, mini. Logo swap, Tyler Male Reds. Gary Carter, Expos, the retired player. SP, Expos or Nationals, I believe. Well, Jimbo, you should have thought about uh, what I say all the time. You know, about speaking things into existence. So, if anyone's to blame, Jimbo, I know you don't want to hear this. It's probably you. You spoke that negativity into existence. Shame on you. Dylan Cousins, Philly's autograph. I think that's like the second one. Can you, there we go. Philly's a little something for you. 
Say positive things next time, Jimbo. Try that for a change. I know it's hard when you skunk. But, but just try, try it. Just try it. Just try it. See what happens. And the last box. Feel like you're walking down the street naked? <laughs> Just don't burn me like uh, like Homegirl did in Game of Thrones. After they shamed her, she straight up killed the entire freaking city. With, what was it, like green fire or whatever? I forget what they call it, but it's like a green fire. Oh, Game of Thrones, right around the corner. Jimbo, still, I, if you know, I'm, I'm, I got my boys back. I got my boys back forever. I blame you, Jimbo. You should have been positive way back. I'm just saying, man. I know it's tough when you skunk, but you don't want to compound that negativity by speaking even more negativity into existence. It's not good for your health. You know, you you, you, stre you stress out. That's not good. You know, at least if you're positive and you continue to skunk, you know, at, at least in your mind you're like, well, you're, you're positive about. I don't know, whatever. I'm talking shit here, as usual. Jason sending you a mystery box. Well, I'm a, that's he's your handler. So the little, I, the less I know, the better. Like I said, he is your handler. Auburn clinched their first Final Four in school history. Yeah, Auburn not known to be a basketball school. So the fact that they are in the Final Four is cool for them, man. Good for them. All right. Last box, Mojo. Good luck, everyone. The Thunder, my Trout Tarot card. Excuse me. Whit Merrifield. Royals out of Grayf. Check the books. For the bazookas, so far we found, I think, two bazookas. Jimmy Queen, Fortune Teller, Kyle Tucker Mini. Knowing Jason is going to be something nicer than Chronicles. Chris Davis, A's fortune teller mini. Juan Soto for the Nationals to 250. The logo swap, Salvador Perez, Royales.
Well, Jason's going to cover for me for a couple days. I don't know when he plans on being in the office. I don't know if that's what he told you, Jimbo, but I know for a fact he'll be here Tuesday and Wednesday covering for me. And I'm going to give him the weekend off. So, you know, so you can spend some some weekend time with the fam. Ronald Cunha Jr., mini for the Braves. Michigan State roaring back on an 11-0 run. Up by two right now uh, on Duke. The magician, Kershaw Dodgers. Tarot card. Why, Jimbo? Is that something you're you're trying to do now? Michigan State up by four. Duke falling apart in the first half here. Luckily, there's still a second half to play. Christian Yelich, Brewers, working center mini. No name play for the Cardinals rookie, Dakota Hudson. Jackie Robinson for the Dodgers. Retired player, SP. What's up, JMS? Tell your friend I said, what up? Are there any breakers based out of Australia, Jimbo, that you know of? Carlos Santana, Phillies autograph. Phillies uh, did pretty good in this half case. I think they got like three autos. I'm going to recap it here shortly. Almost done. And I still got to open up the Chrome Packs. Aaron Judge, Yankees tarot card. Right, let's look at the back of this. No bazookas. That's going to be it. Alright, let's open up these uh, chrome cards here. See what we got. Alright, we got Javi Baez of the Cubs. Arenado Rockies. Segura for the Phillies to 150. Cabrera Tigers. Anderson Marlins, Dijon Cardinals, Bellinger, Dodgers, I think that's a variation, code 365. I think that's the 4th of July, or maybe the player weekend, but that's definitely a variation. Very nice. Good catch, Uncle Jesse. I know, I know. Jose Abreu, White Sox, Chrome, Verlander, Astros. Yeah, I can imagine. Jimbo. Segura, Phillies. The Ground Mets. Shorber Cubs. <laughs> Last but not least, O'Hearn Royals, Goldschmidt Cardinal, and Peralta for the D backs to 150. That's going to do it for that. So let's review our auto grails, shall we? Alright, so here's what we got. Out the way, sir. We got Santana Phillies, Merrifield Royals, Cousins Phillies, Muncie Dodgers, Martinez Cardinals, Adams Rays, Fultonowicz Braves, 
a redemption for Kikuchi of the Mariners, a Mitch Hanniger for the Mariners, numbered to 150, and a Dylan Cozens for the Phillies with the bazooka back, eBay 101, numbered 125, if you're into that. And that's going to do it for the break. Thank you, everybody.